everyone! So today I'm going to be doing a first impression on the new Ofra Cosmetics and Nikki Tutorials collection. I got both highlighters, so I thought I'd do one on one side and one on the other so we can see what it looks like. So this is Space Baby, which is the one I was most excited for. I don't know if you guys can... It's absolutely beautiful. I haven't watched a ton of reviews on this, and Nikki didn't do a video on it, so I'm... Not sure, I just really like fun highlighters like this, so I wanted to try it. I'm just gonna be using this Real Techniques contour brush because I usually use that for highlighter anyway. My makeup's like crazy today, so don't even like, don't even worry. It's a bad makeup day, but um, I don't have any highlighter. Just blush, contour, foundation, concealer, all that jazz. One, two, three. So, not a lot came off. So oh, I'm just gonna... Oh, okay. Well, I mean, I see you. Mm. It didn't pick up, so we're gonna go in again, and I'm just going lightly. But from what is on my face is gorgeous, so... Ooh, yes, honey. Yes, honey! Oh, my wood. Okay, so... You guys can see that, right? Like, it's gorgeous. So this is like two layers, I'd say. Um, it's really freaking beautiful though, right? Like, oh my god. I love it. All right. Okay, so that is Space Baby. Now let's go into Cloud Nine, which looks like this. It's really pretty. It's like a pink peachy shade. It's definitely more subtle, like, it's definitely way more subtle than this, but I'm gonna build it up just to see if I can get anything that's just a little bit more, oh, yeah, okay, this shit is buildable, mm-hmm, girl, oh. I like them both, so I'm very happy. These highlighters are freaking expensive, though, <laughs> like, um, we're we'll gonna talk about the price in a bit, cause mm, you fancy have. Oh yeah, I love shades like this for the inner corner. So, hell to the fucking yeah! I'm gonna put Space Baby down the bridge of my nose. Oh, oh my good, dig. Hi. Oh, hard on this nose highlight today. Let's just. Get a little thin there, why not, right? And I'm gonna put Cloud9 over that because I'm a rebel. <laughs> if you wanna fucking be a galaxy queen, this is fucking hype. Alright, so. There we go. Ooh, 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 honey! Okay, yeah, and then on the chin, we cannot neglect this chin. Mmm. My cat is whining. Bleep out all the swearing. I gotta stop. First impressions wise, these are really freaking nice. Like I've, I have um, glazed donut by Ofra. That's the only Ofra highlight I have, and it's pretty. But I'm really, really, really into these intense, um, weird colors, pretty much. So this is like my type of color. So I'm hyped. So again. That's Space Baby, and that's Cloud9. Now, do you need both? Mm, it really depends. Cloud9 is a lot more subtle, so if you're into a more subtle highlight but you want something a little bit out there, I'd go with this. But if you're more like me and you like more intense shades, I would definitely go for this because it's just, just banging, man. I mean, look at that. Like, yes, honey. Like, I'm, I'm never gonna get over that. Like, I love it so much right Here, now. I'll do finger swatches too. Not that they fucking do anything, but. So there is cloud nine. And here's space baby. Oh yeah, you can see how like more intense space baby is. Yes. Like, I don't wanna be one of those like fucking hipster kids, but 
Like, how can you not swoon over that? All right, so my final thoughts on this as a first impression. I really freaking love these. Um, Price-wise, they're expensive. Um, if you're in the States, you can order them off of Ofra's website and you can use discount codes, like Nikki has a code, all this stuff and get like 10% off, I think. If you're like me and you live in Canada, I ordered off of Count On Us store and um, use code BEAUTY15, I think, for 15% off your like order or something. Those you pay full price on there, but for us Canadians it works because then you're not paying an extra 20 bucks in customs, so it works out. But honestly, for the quality, at least first impressions wise, I'm really obsessed with these. I'm definitely gonna do a full review once I've used these more, just to see, because we don't know the wear time or anything. But first impressions wise, I'm pretty obsessed. Um, yeah, first impressions wise, I'd give these a go. Um, like I said, I'll definitely do a full review once I've used these enough because y'all know even if I'm not wearing makeup, I'm gonna be wearing a highlighter. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this first impressions. If you did, please remember to subscribe. Make sure to follow my Instagram, Makeup by Tasha XO. As always, links are down in the description. And yeah, I'll link the review once I do the full review. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!